Hello everyone, thank you so much for clicking this video. I'm Sunday Ayewale and in this film today I want to show you how I was able to bake this project. I made this Chelsea Boots project in the workshop in here and I, uh, after I'm done, I thought to try to show you how I will be baking it with a shoe polish. A wax shoe polish, a shoe cream is what I will be using to change the look of this to the desired look I want it to be. So come with me right now to see how I will be changing this step by step. I'm going to be baking it. I call it baking. I'm going to be baking it right now. I'm going to be baking it, don't forget, with a shoe wax special. If you want to understand how I will be baking this with a shoe wax polish to this, to, to, to this level, then this for me is for you. Let's go right now to see how I'm going to be doing it step by step. Probably should do this. Follow after that, I will be doing the edges round in there. I'll be so careful. I have to cover the edges together right now. Do the base in there. I will be using this mobile gas with my wax polish. I will be using the brush to shine it, and then this is the wool I'm going to use to cover my hand in the time I'm using to apply the wax polish all around. So, right in there, this is what I will be using for this to get this done right in here. I have to come over and don't forget my work decks needs to be covered. The wax polish can split, so I have to use the a leather to first cover it up, right? Cover the base of my work desk up. After I cover it up, then pick my gas, install my gas. This I'm gonna be using this to eat up the shoe at the point at which I apply the wax polish on it right now. Come with me to see this. Using this all around to cover to apply the wax polish around the shoe because this is a soft cutting. This is a soft cut, and this is going to soak in the wax. And remember, I will be applying the wax while it's out. So I'm going to soak in the. It's going to soak in the wax after I will put. Um, I heat it up. Currently, eating the wax polish. I want to use the shoe cream. I want to use. I'm, I'm eating it up. At time is hot. It does look really and then start using this, pick it up, and then use this to spread it evenly on the shoe. You're gonna spread it evenly. You see, I'm using a dark brown on this particular shoe. Remember, the shade of this shoe it is a brown, so I'm using a dark brown polish on it. You're gonna see the outcome of this. The outcome of this is gonna be very, very great. We'll spread it evenly round. Let's spread it go around evenly this is going to be made easy with the cutting i have round my two fingers you know that's going to make it so so easy so i'm going to spread it out right now just spreading it up let it balance evenly applied round even the apply round apply around for the first time the next thing you're gonna be doing right now is to then pick up the gas and eat it up the mobile traveler gas the kitchen gas cooking gas can also do this too you know eat it up I time I eat this up then the wax polish gets soaked in by the dye then and then start applying another round on it the next one I'm gonna be applying right now is the shade I'm gonna be turning it around with the darker color right now I'm going to be using black along the edges right now black but I want to tone this up on the tip so I have a very dark black and then white the other part as a darker shade of brown uh, I'm done got to the point at which I need to get two shades of it on it then I have to be very careful to blend carefully blend it all around you have to be carefully blend it all around so it's just concentrate the other shade to at the point at which you want it to be after i'm done with this the next i will be doing is the, to pick a neutral cream
cream to cream to then laminate it up. So we'll be doing that with a neutral cream right now. Or we'll be using this to laminate it to cover it up for the surface of the waxing to be closed. That's what I will be doing with this cream shoe cream. The cream, the, the, the neutral one shade of it, that's what we'll be using right now to cover it up. At the time I cover it up, the next thing to then, to then eat it up again with uh, mobile gas. At the time I eat it up, then the polishing it sets. Application of the polish is fully set. Time to get all the tape run off the sole. At the same time, at the time I get it off, and then I plant a set of polish to cake the sole itself up. By the time I apply a set of polish to cake the sole itself up, then we're done with it. So it's it's easy, just like this. The next thing I'm going to be doing at the time we've been able to cake this up with the wax shoe cream right now is today pick my soft brush and then brush this out brush it and then that's what i will be doing right now but it's not really glittering so we want it to go glittering we want it to go glittering so the more force you put on it the more speed the more utter this goes on where you brush you the uh, the motion it's gonna come out you want to see yourself in it like a mirror then you have to shine it more so i will be doing that right now to this so i'm gonna brush it you see brushing it with a lot of strength and this at this point you need to require a bit of strength and if i have industrial polishing machine it will have do it with a twinkle of an eye but at the absence of that i will be using my brush to brush it brush it out and as you can see the shiny thing is gradually coming out brush it out brush it tips brush every part of it and at that point i'm done with it you can see it's so easy we'll be able to change and bake this shoe all around what i've just used was just a wax polish i've just used a wax polish to change the look of this you can see it's now glittering right now so thank you so much for watching this if you like this give us a thumbs up for this like subscribe and click the bell button for you to be notified on a subsequent upload on this platform don't forget i'm all your wireless sunday and whatever you do in here never stop learning yeah. thank you so much for watching this time hope you like what you've seen don't forget give us a like subscribe and while you're subscribing click on the notification bell all this is just to encourage us to do more video like this for you the notification will give you an opportunity for you to be notified on a subsequent upload of awesome project like this on this platform i'm all your sunday and whatever you do never stop learning